What's up guys? Um, today we're going to be doing leg day, everyone's favorite day. We'll be starting out with sprints and then we'll go to dumbbell squats. From there we'll take it to um, dumbbell lunges uh, with pauses as well as uh, some hip extensions with donkey leg kicks and then we'll also be finishing up with some dumbbell calf raises. It's going to hit, you know, kind of everywhere around your legs and you're definitely going to be feeling it by the end of it. So I hope you guys enjoy. Okay, so as mentioned before, we're gonna start off our leg day workout beginning with sprints. You're gonna wanna measure out a distance of about 40 yards. When you start at the beginning of the line and count yourself down, it's important to keep in mind the main concept behind this high intensity exercise to fully explode off the starting line. It helps to put all your weight on your front leg, explode, then gradually straighten out your back until you're fully extended standing tall around 10 yards into the sprint. As you do this, make sure to keep your knees up and arms blasting through the entire duration of the sprint. Dumbbell squats are great if you're trying to work on your glutes, hammies, and quads. It's incredibly important to keep your back straight and distribute the weight evenly in front of you at all times. You may feel this in your shoulders as well from holding up the weight. I got creative and added in pauses between the squats to really feel the stretch and eliminate any power I was getting strictly from momentum. Dumbbell front lunges are one of my favorites. They isolate each leg and blow up your quads. Similar to squats, you must keep your back straight at all times. Make sure to do these slowly and controlled, not swing the weight when you lunge down. Here, I also added in one second pauses so we can really get our money's worth of each stretch from each leg. The hip extensions and donkey kicks are a nice point of change in the workout to using pure body weight. They both work your hip flexors, hammies, and glutes. 12 reps of the side hip extensions along with 12 reps of donkey kicks is one full set. We'll be doing four of these. I added in one second holds to help fully feel the stretch like before. The last exercise in this leg workout will be dumbbell calf raises with one second holds. Here I got a wooden plank and was able to add in some elevation which enables me to hit and cover more surface area of the calf muscle. As you perform these, make sure to go down slowly and stay in control of your body. All right, guys, and that's a wrap to the leg workout. I hope you enjoy absolutely murdering them. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you next time.